Hello everyone. Happy Wednesday. Ooh, review time. All right. The Okay Witch and the Hungry Shadow by Emma Steinkellner. I'm giving this three stars. So this is the second book in the series. Um, and yes, I have read the first one. So in this graphic novel, Moth is, um, dealing with a lot of issues at school, getting bullied, getting teased. Nobody likes her. She has one friend, but other than that, she doesn't have a lot of friends. So when her and her mom go to have Kate, I don't know if I'm saying that right, for their grandmother's, um, celebration, I forget the name of it. She notices this little necklace in her grandmother's pocket that she takes, and the Nile come. And apparently, that is some, she overhears, and that's something that she can use to make her more popular. So she takes it and starts using it, and it does make her popular, but there's a price to be paid with that. Hungry Shadow. Anyway, so I like. I like the series. I like the book. The graphics are great. Um, the main selling point in this for me is Laszlo, the cat, her familiar, because he just makes the book for me because he's so cute and I love him. So if it wasn't for Laszlo, I don't even know if I would continue reading the series, but that is a major plus for me. So good story. Um, she's a little annoying because you know, she just wants to be, I call her annoying because she's just doesn't like, she wants to be popular. I get it. And I get that that's how kids are, but she just does a little extreme in this one. But the end, everything is good. So, of course, happy ending. So, <laughs> but it is good for kids to read because, again, how to deal with bullies, that it's not always great to be popular, that you should just be yourself. Good moral. All right. So once again, that was the OK Witch and the Hungry Shadow. And this is what the back looks like. <laughs> and by Emma Steinkellner. And I'm giving it three stars. All right. Uh, that's it for me today. Everyone, hope you're just having a great day. And um, I'll see you guys next time.